What is going on ladies and gentlemen? Today we are here to look at our last rendition to the Gorilla Fruits e-juice line. We have the Wild Berry. Taking a walk around the bottle, it has the same look as the other Gorilla Fruits did. You will have a exp expiration date plus the VGPG ratio on the bottle. It is a 70-30 VGPG blend. This one is best used by 312 of 2021. So on the front of the bottle, <clears throat> you can see a bunch of different fruits in there and the gorilla, just a normal uh, gorilla fruits bottling uh, like the other ones. Here's the mango right here. So the wild berry itself is described as a explosion of mouth-watering sweet fresh mixed berries um, invigorate your taste buds with this mixed berry blend <clears throat> so um, what I expect out of that is uh, all different types of berries raspberries blueberries strawberries so I have vaped a little bit out of this but we got a fresh wick in here I have taken a couple pulls off it <clears throat> we have the Torin RDA, the review for this will be coming on Friday, and the Asmodus Minikin V2 mod. So let's go ahead and have a vape and see how she is. So <clears throat> It's a pretty strange combination of flavors. It's uh, it's hard to pick up on one particular flavor. I'd say the inhale, I'm getting a mix of strawberry with something else on the back end of the inhale. I think it's a strawberry with like a, a, a light blackberry, something of that nature on the inhale. As you transition to the exhale, transitioning to the exhale, I'm getting a raspberry. It's like a, it's a raspberry, strawberry, maybe a little blueberry mixed into the exhale. Very different flavor. It's uh, pretty much just a bunch of different berry type fruits mashed into one all mixed together to make this one flavor. It confuses the taste buds greatly. It's very hard to detect one distinguishing uh, flavor in this. definitely get strawberry in there and raspberry and I think I'm getting a, a like a blackberry and a blueberry mixed in the back end notes of it but I would say the strawberry pulls ahead just slightly as the most predominant flavor but it, you really have to pay attention in order to tell that that is the more stronger flavor in this blend. Definitely a pretty crazy blend. Is it something I could vape all day? Uh, I could probably vape it for a few hours in an RTA, but um, I would probably get pretty sick of it after a few hours. It's just a little bit confusing of a blend to me. Some people may love it, but it's a little confusing to me. I like to be able to pick out the notes in a juice with no issue and be like, yep, that's that and that's that. This one's a little harder to do that. Some people might like that. So um, yeah, if you go to shopemb.com and uh, you've never purchased from them before, you can sign up for their newsletter. You, um, you will get 25% off of the Gorilla Fruits or the Gorilla Custard line. Um, 
by signing up for their newsletter. If you've already done that, if you use code REBUILDABLE15, all caps, you will get 15% off of anything on Shop EMV's website. If you've already signed up for the newsletter, uh, the 100 mil bottle is $24.95 before the discount. 60 mil is $19.95. Comes in 0, 3, and 6 milligram blend, and you can get an iced version of this. So, that completes the Gorilla Fruits line. It's been a pleasure reviewing all four of them from the line, plus they have an ice version of all the four that I have reviewed from this line. So, I hope you guys have had a good time watching this video, and we will see you on the next one for the Torin RDA.